I need to constantly, constantly imagine myself a state where I'm in direct connection with the Creator who's before me and that I would want to think of Him and I want to do something nice to Him pleasant this is my entire inclination my thought, my desire my internality is aimed in this way externally I do all those things I have to do in this world that's something else, that's externality together with that I'm constantly locked on the Creator. Again, that same example as a mother who's at work somewhere, but her head is constantly, her heart, or constantly with the baby that she left back home. What's up with him? Similarly, we have to imagine ourselves. And of course, when we try to lock ourselves in this way, then various disturbances will come and we'll need to work against them. To work against the, the, these disturbances, I have several supporters. First of all, it's the group. And if we think of one another, we are if you are in Arvut, if we are in a covenant, if we're in support of one another, as we remember, a person does not release himself from prison, he can do it, only the friends. So if I'm connected to them and everyone is connected to everyone, then surely we succeed. And we pl position ourselves in such a way that everyone is in a mutual concern to be in mutual help to be aimed towards the Creator and use our power to neutralize all the disturbances and the disturbances grow and we grow in the connection between us and each time more and more right? talk about it